So I thought I'd do a video about the most difficult tanks to look after and I think most people say the smaller the tank is the more difficult it is to keep clean but um, I believe when you have a little fry in a tank it's quite time consuming um, you have to be extra careful that you don't siphon young fry at the tube when you're gravel vacuuming. I mean you probably pick up a lot of eggs while you're doing that but you know when you have so many fish in a small tank um, it does take a lot more cleaning. Um, it's not so bad when the fry are just tiny like these. Um, but I do like my tanks to look fairly nice. Um, this is about the third clean I've given them in the last week. Um, I take about 10% of the water out sometimes. Sometimes I'll move just one thing at a time. I may clean the rocks, I may clean the wood, I may rearrange the plants. Um, doesn't mean that I give it a major clean every time. I did take off some of the algae off the back, not all of it, just to uh, make it look a little bit tidier. Um, and cleaned my the tubes from the um, under gravel filter. If that is the only problem you do kind of have with under gravel filters as the tubes get quite dirty. This side hasn't. Um, I don't know why. But the other side is quite grubby. They get grubby inside. But uh, I just put plants in front of them. <laughs> and then forget about them. So that's my biggest problem. I think if you're going to breed fish. Um, which I never plan to do. Um, if you're going to breed them have to realise that it's a lot more hard work than just having a tank. Um, at some point, once these babies really start to grow a bit bigger, I will move their parents to a different tank. But um, I've had a hundred plus baby guppies in a 10 gallon, um, along with their parents and few other fish and um, it's a lot of cleaning I think that's partly why I don't recommend guppies or mixed guppies as male and females as first fish um, you just get so many babies And it can be quite overwhelming when you see them. Um, you know, imagine never keeping fish before and waking up every morning to maybe 100, 150 new fish in your tank. And um, I believe that's quite overwhelming for somebody who's new to fish keeping. So if you're going to keep... Um, anything that breeds quite quickly I would make sure you only get one sex um, my male guppies have lived quite happy long lives on their own they don't really need females um, in fact they do live longer um, and if you get some extremely pretty female guppies um, you can just keep those they are brilliant fish for keeping a tank clean they will eat every scrap of food that's in your tank um, they will hunt all day for food I think they're um, brilliant as a clean up crew only the females, the males really have little interest but the females will hunt for food all day so if you're going to go into breeding um, deliberately just remember that it is a constant clean. Um, it's 
especially when we start to get a bit bigger and um, I can't have these amount of fish in a tank without water changes every other day, every three days.